I tried to make a cinnamon roll waffle two different ways. That's because the first one, well, you'll see. I'm using the stuffler again, which you've probably seen in previous videos. I immediately thought of stuffing everything that goes on a cinnamon roll inside the waffle. By the way, you'll find this whole recipe on the website. I made the brown sugar cinnamon filling and probably one of the most dangerous things you could give me, cream cheese frosting. I'll just eat this for lunch or dinner. So in my head, I thought the first one was gonna turn out way more beautiful than how it did in real life. Why did I think the brown sugar would keep its shape? Why? So I thought, how can I make this look more like a cinnamon roll? I guess my only option was the frosting. But just like standard cinnamon rolls, we wait until it fully cools down before frosting. Otherwise, it'll just melt. Wait, I'm really surprised. It doesn't look the best, but it's nice because you get a crispiness from the caramelized sugar. Okay, I'm gonna try this one. This one doesn't have as much brown sugar or cinnamon flavor, but I can really taste the frosting. This. 